Right, I think I'm recording. How are you, everyone? Um, yeah, I'm, yeah, I'm all right. I've come today to make a little video to tell you my plans. Um, oh, and you can see my new shed I've been building. This absolutely knackered me building it. Not finished yet, but uh, I'm in it now. And, uh, well, I've actually moved into it, my new shed while the wagon is uh, being refurbished. The floor gave way over there. Um, yeah, so this is my new shed. I like it. It's rather like, I'll draw this curtain. It's rather like living in a, a tree house. I'm sorry, if you look over there, um, you can see through the window, the, the hedgerow and beyond that, the field. <laughs> Go a little bit closer for you. I look out the window and I see the hedgerow, which is really rather nice. It's like, as I say, it's like living in a tree house. There's my bed. I've made a little bunk bed, like a ship's bunk. Uh, up there is going to be locked in with, it's going to be a cupboard situation. And, uh, Got a kitchen, very nice, a bit more room. I've got a bathroom uh, with those top windows there. I can look out of them while I'm having a shower, which is very nice. See the birdies walking in the hedgerow. So that's nice. And uh, and there's Bonnie, she likes it. I haven't finished, I haven't done the floor yet, and even to the floor. So that's going to get into a bit of a state if I'm not careful. Uh, Mia's outside on her sofa. Um, and yes, I, I sit here like this. And, oh, my Bonnie's come to join me. Bonnie, Bonnie. Yes, Bonnie's got used to it straight away. I mean, I've been here a few days now. It's not finished. I mean, look at the ceiling. It's not painted. Nothing, the walls aren't painted. The only thing that's been done is the bathroom. I've got that dresser out of the garage. I'm going to paint that a different colour so it's much lighter and not so, so dark in my face. I'm going to try and make it look a little bit like the the natural colour of my desk. It's over there. Yeah, Bonnie, I'm going to get up, I'm afraid, Bonnie, because I'm talking to my friends. So you can stay there, Bonnie. You stay on this chair, and I'll go and sit by my desk. Oh. All right. Say hello. Yes, Bonnie likes it in here. Anyway, I haven't really come on to tell you about the shed, but I, you know, I know some of you are curious about it. What I'm here for today is to tell you that I'm, I'm going to retire, semi-retire from YouTube. It's um, taken over too much of my life and uh, the other thing is when I go I go on my bike which I love I'll still be going on my bike but um, I start talking about going on long journeys and camping and uh, because that's what uh, my heart wants to do or my head tells me I can do but the reality of it is that next month I'll be 77 and uh, it's quite elderly, you know. Not that I look it, but sometimes it's just a bit overwhelming for me, and I keep thinking, "Oh, I'll do this for my subscribers. I'll do that." And uh, but the truth is, I'm not going to go on any long journeys. Um, it's just, it's just not sensible, you know. If I got, if I went camping, got caught in a 
downpour or whatever, caught pneumonia. I know it's the worst seen scenario I'm giving, but these things can happen. It could be the end of me. I'm not really as well as I look, you know. You know I've got heart problems, because I've told you. But I've got the other associated things that old age brings. And uh, I've just got to be a bit more sensible. So this um, this channel is going to go back to what it originally started at, which was just me, really, just being myself, pottering around the place, making stuff, telling stories, singing the occasional song for your pleasure. <laughs> <laughs> and <coughs> excuse me of course I still will go on, uh, on my motorbikes I'll keep doing that as long as long as possible but this all this talk I'm giving about going on long camping trips it's, it's impractical I've just got to be honest it's not going to happen and I didn't want you to be thinking oh yeah Maybe we'll get a long camping trip, because I don't think it'll happen. You might get a short camping trip, but uh, the long trips to Scotland are not going to happen. And not unless I go, go on a train and hire a vehicle when I get up there, something like that. But uh, even then, I don't think I'll be camping. I'll probably be staying in a and b or something. Uh, so I just wanted to tell you that, that um, the channel... And it won't be, there won't be such regular things on it because, um, to be honest, I just want to get on my bike, my motorbikes, and I just want to go for a ride. And I don't want to be bothered with um, setting up the camera and thinking of things to say as I'm riding along and then coming back and uploading it and it not going right. I mean, I've spent hours sometimes. Um, making videos, editing them, and then nothing happens. They're gone. It's a bit like what happened here on my... This, this morning, this is the second attempt, I think I told you, of making this video. And, uh... Because I, I did it on my laptop. And when I reviewed it, you couldn't hear a bloody word I was saying most of the time. So these things, you know, they're frustrating. And, uh, I want to go back to just being an old bloke pottering about the occasional motorbike ride and my artwork and writing and telling stories, things like that. So I just thought I'd clear that up. And when when you hear me talking about going on a long journey, just, just say to yourself, oh, the old bloke's being stupid again. Because I probably am, you know. My head is so young in there. In my head, I'm 35 years old. My body tells me different. Anyway, I just thought I'd pop in and say that and uh, hope you've enjoyed looking around my little humble abode. That's it for now. Take care of yourself and uh, what, what can I say? I'll just be making Still making videos, maybe not quite so often. And uh, sitting here, having a smoke of my pipe. And um, that's about it. But there's no, not going to be any long journeys. And I'll try and stop talking about it. I'll try and stop talking about what's in my mind. <laughs> uh, regarding camping, that is and long motorbike journeys. Okay, thanks for looking in. Um, I'll see you again soon, I hope. Ronnie's on the table. I don't think... She, I actually like her being on the table. But uh, I want her to be comfortable in her new little home. Oh, and Mia's uh, old, old dog now. She doesn't want to go walking. I just want, I, you know, I'm, I don't, I don't want to uh, make any final decisions about her. I'm hoping that nature will take its course with her and she'll have a comfortable ending. 
Anyway, I don't want to talk about that. So I don't want to end on that sad note. She's all right. She's still eating and uh, she can still wander about the paddock. A bit like me, really. <laughs> OK, I'm going to say goodbye. Lots of love to you all. Thanks for being my subscribers. Thanks for all the likes and the views. You'll take care. Bye. Bye.